Hi there, welcome back to my channel, Yorkshire Lofts. Okay, so as you can see, I will be using this leftover wood uh, to make my rustic looking uh, pigeon nesting box. As you probably already recognized if you watched my previous videos, I'm still using these uh, these lats why I have uh, cut out from a uh, 6x6 uh, fence panel. So, um, same again, I will be sanding these down and obviously cutting them to size. Uh, these are horizontal and uh, vertical lats, I just need to sand them down. And uh, that will be it. Okay, as you can see from that image, uh, I'm using all the uh, recycled stuff uh, I had laying around. Uh, some of these bits I found in my uh, toolbox. So the galvanizer, staple nail and uh, steel wire, uh, they were already on these panels. I had to uh, remove uh, to prepare these uh, panels and the wire mesh you can see that's uh, left over from my Avery built so I would say 90% probably more uh, is uh, all recycled material even the plyboard underneath uh, I will be using that for the rear section of the box again uh, that's why I'd laying around so I haven't gone anywhere to buy any of these materials. Right, uh, let's have a look at all these pieces. So I've got my horizontal panels, vertical and these uh, smaller, the thin ones, uh, they will make up the cage section and next to that, those panels, they will uh, be for the door. And the last one in the row, uh, they will uh, bind the full structure together. And the wire mesh, uh, I will use that for the door. What you can see now in front of you, uh, that's everything I will be using other than uh, screws and nails to complete this uh, full build. So the dimensions in uh, millimeters. I have decided to go for 600 long, 300 high and 350 wide. So yeah, so you can see now, uh, put the basic uh, box structure together and ready for rear and uh, the front section to complete. From this footage, uh, you can see I have made the door and the case section and uh, the rear section, I have cut that out of a uh, ply board uh, I showed earlier so okay it's pretty much done I need to get a wire mesh on this door and uh, finally uh, I will be sanding all this down and I uh, give it all a good clean so it's completed as you can see I have put the door on and uh, also wire hook to keep the door shut and uh, yeah it look, looks, looks well um, pretty, pretty happy with how, how this uh, turned out and uh, I will be putting in a loft uh, in the morning. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. I will catch you on the next video.